Hey everybody, welcome back. We're 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 eating. We're eating on the weekly this week. I think I've I've surmised routes for success. It turns out, and this may surprise you, maybe a, a magical reactor. Imagine a Sundere nuclear reactor. Oh, please don't. Um, uh, where am I going with this? <laughs> please uh, don't douse my control rods in order to cool them so they can continue. I, ooh, I don't even know really what Sundere means. Uh, I'm going to take a moth. Anyway, what I was going to say before I got lost in the sauce is um, turns out buying the best units when they show up and avoiding the garbage units really seems to be the ticket this week for doing well. I don't know if, if you've ever considered the strategy of buying the good units, ignoring the bad ones, but it seems to be popping this week. Like, for example, <laughs> an early dolphin. It's amazing. Roll me. I, we didn't have to sell there, but I'm glad I did. How, have you considered an, another thing we've been doing this week more often is taking like an early croissant and then giving the croissant to a unit who can maybe scale a little bit. Now, none of these units are likely to stick around, so you know what I'm going to do. I, it may surprise you. I'm going to put it on the dolphin for a second. Knowing that it might be a few rounds before a pineapple shows up, I think you're the most likely to get maximal yield out of the... Um, out of the resource we just offered to you. Now we actually lose this one. I, th I thought we were a shoe in the wind, but that's okay. We got room to grow. I think we have to sell both beavers. I'm okay with it. If that hit the moth, we were going straight to hedgehog. Guess what? We're going straight to hedgehog anyway. Buff me. Not that interested. I'm going straight back to the buff. I understand how this looks. All I'm going to say to you right now, honestly, is that the rest of the squad, like, th th what we saw in our shop was not inspiring. So I'm happy with what we've got going on here. I'd like to go back on that. <laughs> Turns out having, like, almost any unit at the back probably would have been better, but it, it is what it is. Um, we're going to take one of you. We're going to keep buffing you. It's... Your, your success is very important to us right now. We're lacking a lot. It's a very prospective role, don't get me wrong. We're lacking a lot right now. But we do it, we have snipers and we have like mutually assured destruction even if it's only in the form of a single hedgehog. But the double snipe turned out to not be as effective as I'd like it to be, but hold on, hold on, we win these. I think the way to envision a hedgehog is if you know your team's got a lot of HP, you love it and you take it. If you don't feel like your team has a bunch of HP, then you take it to kind of like give yourself worse winning chances but better drawing chances if necessary. You know what? I'm going in on the clownfish here. I got to give it a chance. We got, we got units very close to leveling. And then you yeet it as soon as you feel like you've gotten over the hump. Now, I definitely don't feel like we've gotten over the hump yet. However, however, this seems very draw, this seems very winnable to me. And I, I know people love to see the clownfish and I don't really give it the, it's due day on the catwalk that often. Beautiful, we could have two of them. But I think we're better off with two dolphins right now. Actually, I think we're better off with a dolphin and a lynx. For the moment, give me a grape. But we're, the problem we have right now is our team is very... Uh, we don't have a lot of HP. Like, our next loss puts us on lethal, so we gotta get on the freaking ball. That was the only way that things could have gone that would leave me feeling good about the way our odds looked here. So I, I'm very thankful for that. <laughs> that, what a snipe from the Lynx. I don't think we want a next level hedgehog. I'm actually gonna can. I know, it's a rarity. We need a pineapple on a dolphin, but we already have a croissant on the dolphin. So let's go Lynx first, and our next pineapple will go dolphin. And then wouldn't you know it, we go two cans, which again, is, I don't think it's the kind of stuff you really want to buy when you're... Basically, you're one away from lethal. But maybe I could get slightly... Lucky, perhaps, perchance. 
No, I'm looking at this team and I'm like, this they're gonna blow us away. Look at this squad, it's incredible. Okay, can we get some levels, please? That's the whole reason the clownfish is here. I'd even take a clownfish level. That's rough. Go ahead, take one of those. Roll me. Please. I need a level. In order for this to... Okay, you have to... It's your time to go. Don't get me wrong. Roll me. You didn't even give me a level after I went for the psycho roll. Three, four, three, three. Well, I'm not going poodle. <laughs> Um, there's our kangaroo level. I think, if I'm being honest with you, I think we got a little screwed by the shops. But I also think we could win this round. Killing the kangaroo was, was very important. You're also a kangaroo. No, we've lost. I... I think we got, it. we got a little screwed by the shops and losing in the mid game. But you know what? It is what it is. We probably had different options available to us that might have given us more control over our future. I'll take a beaver and an iguana, and I'll take two beavers, please. And, uh, I don't know. None of these are great. Let me be a nasty warrior. Sounds like a, the, a two mana unit in a Hearthstone ripoff. You don't need to have a good team if the person you're going up against is just running fish fish. Maybe they know something I don't know. Give me a two three. Just give me the, just give me the freaking moth, okay? I we don't need two moths in order to get peak moth efficiency. We're gonna win, holy cow! One moth is enough to guarantee your front unit gets a one for one on turn two. It's just arithmetic, okay? Now levels, very important. We get some levels. I hate you. Um, I, I, go ahead, shoot the messenger. Don't, don't buff the beaver. Don't buff the beaver, you piece of junk. Never mind, actually, that's pretty good. So wh what am I doing here? Well, it's very simple. I'm using the hedgehog to, to, to draw. I'm bringing the hedgehog back as a draw master. Sometimes it might do better than draw. Sometimes it might give you a win. Now, I'm going to... I'm going to stave off Oblivion for a minute, knowing that you're going to level up. I'm going to sell you. Love it. Love it. And I list it. I do both of them. I was... There you go. I want to get as many levels as possible next time because I think getting a turn four... Or not, a tier four unit on turn whatever it is coming up is extremely great for us. That's not, though. This is a loss. Okay. If we get a if we get a buffalo, it's over. I spent it. None of this is great. Level me. There's a bison. You piece. I'm gonna say buy me, roll me. Give me the space. A parrot. Okay. I hate it. <laughs> buy me. I love it. He's losing his mind, and I am reaping all the benefits. Okay, I'd love to get a cucumber on this buffalo. Now, I wish we'd gotten that on the first one, but that's okay. We, we got plenty of space to play with. We're not, like, close to lethal right now. Obviously, the more the less losses we could have on route, the better. This, this draw, uh, draw is fantastic. I don't even mind. The hedgehog's going to get unwrapped, and then the whole thing's going to start to come to pass here. We don't even need to unwrap the hedgehog right now, because you know what we can do? We can just do this. We can do this. We can do this. And honestly, I think we're still feeling very... We didn't have to sell anything to make it happen. We got a cucumber burning a hole in our pocket uh, to... Uh, phrasing, maybe, but to, to make our bison that much better until a lemon shows up. Huge. Huge. You don't get to attack again, though. No? Oh, but you still got me. You still... That hurts. That hurts. But I'm still, I have faith in our scaling. You gotta go. You're gonna come in here. You're gonna be our, our buy at the end. We get three triggers, so I'm gonna do a buy me, a sell me. It's a, it's a big investment. It's not not a big investment. And a pineapple for our iguana, potentially. I thought about the donkey. We do, probably the beetle gets unwrapped next. It's only a four, six. 
You've stolen my deer from me. And you've broken my heart, Mr. Burgundy. Oh. <laughs> Two in a row with one HP remaining. Have mercy. Sell me. Honestly, you're gone. Because we want a caterpillar to be on the squad to inherit from the bison eventually. It's very risky, but we got to do something. I know you're like, do starfish buffalo. I'm here to tell you I have done it. I've done it this very weekly. And I've been disappointed by it um, every time. It doesn't mean it's bad because I have seen it work against me. But it does mean that I'm not, I'm not fully sold on it. Okay, with round eight, we got a 13, 15, a 12, nine, and two deer, and a caterpillar that's in the back of the tank right now. Our moth living was uh, never, I don't think it's, wait a minute, are we chilling? We're, we're so, I was, I was ready to cry. I was ready to give up and cry. Instead, we get to four wins. With a team that I actually think is pretty good still. I'm not, the, the thing is messing with me is I'm not disappointed with the team at all. I'm actually pretty, pretty happy with it. Some gold in return. Thank you. Uh, Husky is only hitting basically one unit, so I don't think that's the play. Not interested. Yeah, a moose is kind of like, it's very important. It's extremely good. I would keep your tier three frozen. Okay, well, uh, it's a dream come true. If you want to view paradise, simply look around and view it. Anything you want to, do it. Want to change the world, buddy. <laughs> Join the club, but also there's nothing to it. Don't kill me yet. I, I, I don't deserve it yet. I don't deserve to die. I think we're gonna win. It's just, oh, no! I forgot about the fly. That team could go off. I'm telling you, if we get the buffalo on the first level up that we had on turn five instead of the third one, we go like flawless. This time I, I look at that first shop, I take a fish and then you insult me. You insult me, but I get another fish on the roll. Okay, you know what? Let me be a big bird, that's perfect. I thought about a really funny idea that I don't think would translate to a funny video. This, this kind of thing happens a lot when you have a young child and you watch a lot of Sesame Street. So there's a song called Elmo's Song. You may be familiar with it. It goes, this is the song, la 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 la, Elmo's Song. La 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 la, la 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 la, Elmo's Song. La la la, la la. I think you basically get the idea. Hmm. I would roll for yet another duplicate this early. This is the value of the of, of you, okay? And I'm not pleased with it, honestly. I would rather just take my level and ignore the moths. Sure, why not? Um, right after Elmo's song, in the album version of Elmo's song, Big Bird sings the exact same song, but he changes the lyrics to, to be Big Bird's song. What if you did a video essay trying to expose Big Bird for plagiarizing Big Bird's song from Elmo's song? M completely missing the joke that Obviously, it's plagiarized. They're, um, it's, it's meant to be the same song. You might be saying minus two, and that's why I didn't make it. It's a little strange here. It's not, it's not a normal team we've got going on by any stretch. Okay, this is exactly the unit I wanted to buff, obviously. Um, we're never going level two loyal chinchilla on purpose. So I think, I, I think this team is not good. But I think if we reroll aggressively, Get a level three fish. Holy cow, they placed us against a team that is as bad as we are. It's the dream. If we get a level three fish, that's good stats. Carry you in the mid game. Turn the lights off, carry me home. Na 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 na. Let's get this dodo kicking. And we'll, we'll just buy one of those. We're looking for levels. Nothing really. Um, I, would, I would simply pass this one. A draw would be a miracle. A loss isn't that bad because nine and seven are effectively the same amount of HP uh, when it comes to like the consequences of them as soon as we start to take three damage from each loss. So this, this maybe is not that bad. Win would have been nice, of course. How about one of these? And you know what? It seems like you are going to stick around, so let's scale you. 
And then I'd, I, I can't believe I'm saying this. I think we, we have to buy a Tamarin. We have no impressive units right now, though. The, I, I don't know. I thought we had a pretty good series. Of, I thought we had a pretty good early game shop setup. Clearly, I have no idea what I'm talking about. But maybe just coast a little bit. If you get a little lucky, you never know what the world has in store for you. Not yet. I'm not scaling you yet. You gotta, you gotta prove yourself. Give me my level. A, a bat, maybe? No, you. Oh, sh 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 dolphin. Dolphin. Yes. <laughs> no. Okay. Forget the bat. We're definitely going tamarind, and the tamarind should probably take a croissant at this point, but. I don't have any faint abilities, right? Please? Math? Math? My math? You've mathed it? We've not mathed it? We drew it. I think we're gonna get rid of our bats. Our bat. We're gonna take a Tamarin. We're gonna sell you. I think we're gonna sell you. With God as my witness. I think a seal is the way. Because no matter what the seal buffs, we're loving life. But if it buffs the Tamarin, we get utility out of the Tamarin cell. Please. Please. It, you had the greatest weakness of all time. I gotta give you some credit. Huge crit, though. We still lose. Um, don't put me on lethal yet. This team has barely gotten the chance to, to get off the ground, man. Buff them. Take one of these, we might have... As soon as we're on lethal, we gotta start talking about selling you. And I wish it wasn't the case, but... Oh, that's big stats! No, 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 no. We, we, you know, sometimes you don't get to choose what you got. Gonna get a nice... St that stat gain itself should keep us in the battle. Good snipe. It's not that good. It's not that good at all! Okay, so we, we got to go flawless from this point out. We got to get like seven straight wins with a couple of a smattering of draws. Here's the deal, brother. You're no longer doing enough for us. I wish it wasn't the case. We need something like this. Sure, give it a chance. My thoughts exactly. Seal can deal with that. So you can deal with this. Unfreeze it all. Is there a chance? Is there a chance here? The ostrich is going to be like a 5'11". Me when I tried to join my 8th grade basketball team. Well, I had certainly at this point wish that I had... <clears throat> I... I wish that I'd kept my dolphin that could have gone a lot differently is it, it's all falling apart we used to we used to be something and now we're nothing what is this okay hear me out you gnarly gladiator uh round one and round two are gonna be a disaster but man oh man round seven that trophy's gonna feel sweet. Our first win. I'm going straight for the level two. Crab? I can't believe what I'm seeing here. We may need this. This is not, like, for having four of the same unit in the first two shops, it's not even good. As you can see, like... There's no, there's no utility to it. There's no value to it. A, a fish leveling up matters a great deal. Am I crazy to think that like a kangaroo still has no shot to, to do anything? <laughs> Unless, hear me out. A... Give stats to the front unit, which is yourself. No, give, give stats to your best unit, which is you and then cycle the stats back to you. So we have a 6-4 kangaroo that probably also gets one extra trigger from the 4-2 frog, unless they have a dolphin. 
the order did not work. Did not work the way I thought it would work. Yet, here we are. It, 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 it worked in a way. We got the result we wanted. It's just the moth goes before the frog. You know, the moth goes after the frog. Okay, that makes sense. That may change now. Um, we need to buff a unit. If we're going to get a level 3 frog, we need to buff units that are not frogs. Yeah, this is too much for me. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Um... Um, okay. I'm gonna buff a fish. So that if we sell the fish, we can get... No, if we sell the frog, we can give the fish's stats to something else? Yes, okay. He's, he's sort of started to think about getting it. If that's how it's gonna go down, I don't know. Sure. Stats are going to be valuable. I don't really want to put a croissant on a fish. I'd rather, you know what? Maybe I do want to put a croissant on a fish because I don't know what the heck I'm doing. I'm just clicking. I'm just clicking. It's like we could sell the sell the frog in front of him and and, and such as and and then I'm I'm confused. Is the thing? Hold on. We actually, we, we lost one. Now I gotta actually think a little bit because I was coasting off of stats for a bit there. You gotta go. You gotta status up. Peace. You peace. With God as my witness, I simply don't see a world in which it makes any sense for us to buy the starfish. And I've tried it. I've tried it a little bit this week. I think now, it's like we need this, this. And then the stat swap can work like that. That's better. So now we're gonna have our best unit, our tankiest unit in the front, but our kangaroo is also gonna have good stats by default. No, it's gonna have horrible stats by default. <laughs> Is it because I got sniped? Is that what screwed it up? I'm on lethal, by the way. Amazing. I mean, I'm, I'm just running down the clock on this one. What is this team? If you, this is what happens when I'm forced in, well, when I'm tricked into buying frogs early. Don't snipe me. You've sniped me. This seems like highly unwinnable. I'm running it back. This is a th that run was a disaster. This is how every weekly ends. <laughs> it's like me being like, uh, the meta's passed me by. Sell me. Buy me. Sell me. Place you at the back with some honey. A two two, a two two, a three two, and honey. And let me be a feeble poet. Seems like a lot of them were. Am I right or am I wrong? I'm wrong and I'm dead. The doctor will see you now. That is not how I read that at first. Uh, I read it very differently. Okay, we just had a very efficient shop. Let's have a very un inefficient shop. Can I get... Mm, I'm gonna... I'm tilted. I'm playing... I'm, I know I'm playing on tilt. But there's only like six animals at tier one. This is like a, a stats problem. How many rolls do you have to get to guarantee that you're going to see three of the same animal? Apparently the answer is one more than I'm willing to do. Don't, don't, don't shoot me, brother. Don't shoot me. Okay, you know what? That's good because we're going to get a snail. On level. Please? A level? You're going to witness a man... You're going you're gonna to see a man leave the game. You're going to see a man abandon. Okay. Desperate times call for desperate measures. I took a hedgehog. You believe it or not, the hedgehog is here to stop the tilt. And I don't think it's gonna work. It's not gonna. We we're gonna draw. That it stopped the tilt. Okay. Now you gotta give me a level. Mathematically speaking, we have to have a level. 
it's non-negotiable. You got one round, okay? Look at every unit except the Hedgehog is about to level up. If you're unwilling to give me a level at this point, we are gonna lose this one, by the way. If you're unwilling to give me a level at this point, I, I, I you must have hard-coded something in the game that says, don't give this guy any levels. Especially when there's no chocolate, especially when there's a clownfish. Have you lost your mind? I'm selling you, I'm buying a dolphin. A level. I didn't even know it could, I, I, God is my witness, I didn't know it could happen, okay? You get the hedgehog out of here, run a deer now. We're, the squad is not set up properly. We have a dodo feeding nothing, but nobody has any HP anyway, so I guess maybe it's not as bad as it could be. No, it's still really bad. This is, this is disastrous. We're on zero. Are we on lethal? Yes, I was so prepared to say no. Level me. Okay, sell me and give me some stats. Better. Let's run that donkey right there. Normally you put it at the back, that's okay. We have a pineapple. Okay, just in time to probably lose. I feel like I now have a squad where I can start to talk about um, the future. Holy cow, I didn't get immediately sniped. My, my best unit did get uh, afflicted, but that's okay. It worked out. Okay, See, I told you. We got our levels and now everything's starting to fall into place. Way too late for us to have any chance to adjust, but a shark. Is it possible to rebuild this run in the image of a shark? I think it is. We sell what we just leveled up. I know it's weird to have the donkey up so high. I think we sell the sniper. It's strange. I don't like to sell the sniper. We're generating more hurt triggers. A, a single dolphin will shoot our whale, which is actually like a horrible if it was to happen. This is, I, I can't tell if this is good or bad, but we're alive. Either way, we, we got two wins. Please give me a give me a way out, man. A level two donkey? I don't feel like that's a way out. But it is very humorous. Go ahead. And then like to pill a whale is or to pill a deer is tempting to give you a buff. I gotta pill something. <laughs> Technically, I guess I don't. You know what? I'm pilling a whale to buff our shark. And then I'm throwing out. Anusky for one round. There, all of those could be viable options. The sheep makes sense. The mole makes sense. The husky makes sense. That's probably unlikely to be the decision that's going to change the game. But I could very much be wrong as well. We gambled on permanent stats. And, and you know what? We ended up succeeding. It would be great to pill the husky here if they would give us a chance in an early shop. No, no shot, no shot. Okay, what's the next step? A moose is always valuable. I don't think we need to invest in the dodo. Moose me, roll me. Two moose, okay. I would sell the husky. I would go moose, moose. Freeze me, freeze me. We can't afford to be taking too many shots here. Let me look, five, two, four, five, four. There is a world in which a poodle does something here, but I think it's a little too late. I'm going to accept the 2-2 buff. I'm going to unfreeze you, I'm going to unfreeze you, and I'm going to give our moose a chili pepper. And I'm not harboring any delusions we're going to get to 10 wins. But to get to one more than we have at any given moment, it's enough for me to feel something, okay? Holy cow. A hit tweet. A hit tweet. I'll take it, whatever. How are we doing this? Freeze me, roll me. Freeze me, roll me. I'm not, maybe I can buy you actually, and here's how I'll do it. I'll buy a salad. 
then I'll purchase a dodo. Guarantee us five by five in the shop. Four even seems like a pipe dream at this point, but imagine, imagine. <laughs> Please. Not that big of a deal. Yeah, 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 it's a huge deal. Dude, this, the donkey's doing insane work. And then the chili pepper so that we get to get a free hit on a weak unit. It's, there's something to it. Okay, we need, we need to phrase, keep fives and sixes. Take a small bit of statistical gain. It's not much, but it's honest work. Buy a hot dog and roll me. Roll me. Roll me. That's an insult. We're going all everything down to zero. Nothing frozen. Because our shop needs a, needs a moose in it for us to have a realistic chance at greater respectability. This is a problem. <laughs> it's still a problem. Oh my god, we drew. <laughs> I don't believe it. Oh, dude. it's like the one situation where that could even make any, to even have a hope of uh, drawing. Freeze me, freeze me. I should have been freezing earlier, I'm sure. Freeze me, come on, man. Okay, this is beautiful. We need a lemon. We also desperately need a stegosaurus. So keep the stegosaurus frozen, get rid of everything else. It's hard to imagine what you get rid of in order to put a stegosaurus on the team. Because the moose is our only lifeline long term. They something tells me I'm not going to have to worry about it. Because their strongest unit is at the back and we just lost our strongest unit. Yep. Hey, well, you know what? We fought back from a complete tilt to bring it to respectability. Either way, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. I think I'll see you next weekly. See ya.